right, fellas. This was my first ever everyday carry organizer. I think I got it for like eight bucks on Amazon. And I haven't seen this thing in years. It's kind of stuck in this, you know, bin of EDC stuff that I never use. This is the Nutsack Double Admin in Leather. Yeah, we're playing in a whole different ball game. I got a good one for you guys today. Man, I have never, ever, ever had an organizer as nice as this one. Yes, I've had a whole bunch of them. But man, you talk about leather, <laughs> you talk about quality materials. Nah, I don't I don't think I've ever had the, the pleasure. This this is a nice organizer. Let me give you the dimensions and we'll do some size comparisons. Why not? Because we need to stack up some things up against this thing so you can see how nice it is. All right, the dimensions, nine inches in length, six inches in height, and a width of just 1.5 inches. Yes, this organizer is a little big. It's the double. They have a single on their website. You can check out the single as well. But the double is so nice if you're switching bags. Like you, I'm, I'm in one bag one day and then I'm in another EDC bag another day. Or if you're traveling, you want to carry all your tech. Yeah, this is, this is pretty nice. So here's a Word notebook, regular Word notebook. So you can kind of see it's almost like one maybe two and a half of these. So a good size, a, 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 a good size. It's gonna be a good size in, in a pack. You know, some folks will say it's a little big, but like I said, they make them in two sizes. This is the size I chose. This is a recycled firefighter truckie. Uh, this is the smallest one that they make. You can see this is almost like one, two, two of these, maybe two and a half of these, Re recycled firefighter truckie. Great little simple organizational pouch. This is a, a medium size Defy pouch in X-Pack. So this is almost the same size, almost the same dimensions here. We got like maybe two inches on that side of the pouch, it's a little bigger. But, and this is a large Topo design pouch. This is much bigger, <laughs> covers the whole thing, but yeah. Just wanted to do those size comparisons because when I look at organizers online, I'm like, what, what the hell? Like, how big is the thing? I, I need to know how big it is. So that's how big it is. Um, on the outside, let's go around and do the features, right? You got the little nut. I'm, I, I like I like the little nut. It's subtle. It, it, it's it, it's nice. I love it. This leather is almost like a self healing type of leather. So I've been using this for the last I don't know two three weeks. And so what I notice is like if I make a mark, like I just made that mark right there, you can kind of put your thumb on it because of the oils on the outside of this leather. You can kind of work it, and that mark will slowly kind of disappear. I like that. And then on the outside we're going to talk about the zippers why not we're talking about ykk we're talking about a dual zipper with a nice little pull to it there nice nice little leather pull to it and then on the back it's really simple on the outside guys this is a really simple pouch so it's just got two metal d rings i like the metal it goes along with the luxury kind of the premium feel of this organizer right here. Let's get into it, let's get inside. I mean, why waste any time? And we could talk about the features of this thing. Great zippers, check it out. They're not AquaGuard, but I don't need an AquaGuard zipper on an organizer, you know? Those zippers work just fine. Okay, so we got two sides of organization. In the middle here, I have the pop-off leather uh, this is like a uh, uh, word notebook, field notes cover. It's got George written on it. See, it says George on it. Little red accents. But you're not here for that. You're here for the, the organizer. So you got two pockets on this side. They're good size pockets, all right? They have really heavy wax canvas in the inside. So I got it set up like one side is 
like my tech stuff and then my other side is like my EDC stuff like stuff I might need tools and stuff so I have a charging block these pockets are deep they're they're a good deep size so like this even larger charging block this is like an old school charger block see how it's got the the extra butt end on it Samsung so this will sit down in that pocket and kind of disappear uh, it's the same height as an iPhone that's like a regular iPhone that's my work phone um, so we'll pull that out so you guys can see I have a little handkerchief in there uh, but yeah you can see the size of the pockets there and then on the other side this is like my favorite these are like two of my favorite cords that I go through a lot of them is this longer anchor cord I take this with me traveling so when my battery is dead on my phone and stuff I can still sit and watch and scroll you know and look at Twitter and all of that stuff and then this is like my emergency type of uh, <laughs> chaffron cord that has all the connections for all my kids different stuff so two nice size pockets notice the stitching is excellent you got a bar stitch right here in the middle separating those pockets bar stitches up here that are holding this elastic band down you know you could put some larger items in there kind of stretch them to fit but yeah a lot of different options there it's a made in america guys how can you not like that root for your home team and then on the other side same exact setup uh nice pocket bars tack stitch i did utilize the the band up here daisy chain if you would nice bar tack stitches this is uh just a pin and a sharpie this is an olight you know i gotta i had i felt premium so i went with the premium flashlight and then over here is whoo this is my one of my favorite knives the quiet carry drift this thing is sick i love it knife it's a frame lock i always mess that up frame lock liner lock definitely a frame lock so yeah that that's in my edc bag there and yeah I, what i will say you know you have the space in the middle there and you guys saw that i was able to put flip like my phone my pop-off leather notebook and a bandana right here in the middle that's your 1.5 inches right there in the middle so you could probably put some bigger stuff in there if you wanted to um but for me and my you know my edc setup that those those items let me get it right those items were enough to stick in that center portion for me let me organize it my ocd acting up there you go so in the middle that was enough for me i really like this thing you gotta put your hands on it to kind of appreciate what's all going on and what nutsack is offering you here uh and then when we talk about quality we talk about luxury edc because this is definitely luxury edc i already see the guys in the comments they'll be like man i got a max edition that does the same thing i got a this or that that's like half the price yeah bro you do you definitely can find something that's half the price of this that will organize all of your everyday carry. Will it have this feel? When you pull it out of your bag, there's a different type of, of feeling you get when you put your hands on this. I'm just saying, I don't want to be a salesman. I'm just saying that there's a different feeling than putting your hands on like a Max Edition organizer and a leather organizer. Let me shut up and talk about the price. It's 169, yes! That's as much as a backpack, a real good backpack. Yeah, you gotta pay to play. And uh, they set the price on this, but at the same time, I've seen, when we start talk playing in this space, with le the le luxury leather <laughs> good space, that's a, that's a decent price. Uh, totally made out of leather that's a decent price uh, accessory so i like it i like it nutsack good job thank you for sending it out to me i am using it i just came back from a trip and i definitely put it to work 
we had all my little electronics in there and I was like, mm, let me just grab my nut sack, <laughs> you know? But anyway, guys, if you like this video, man, hit the thumbs up button if you loved it. Subscribe to the channel because it's totally damn free. If you got a question about everyday carry, leave it down there in the comments and I'll try to get back to you and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Wait.